Welcome. It's Meditation Monday when we invite you to be still. Take a moment and dwell on the Word of God as we prepare to ponder on what the Lord has to say. Remove any distractions. Position yourself in a posture to receive and open your heart and mind to the Holy Spirit. Galatians chapter 3, verse 26 to 29. For you are all children of God through faith in Christ Jesus, and all who have been united with Christ in baptism have put on Christ like putting on new clothes. There is no longer Jew or Gentile, slave or free, male and female. For you are all one in Christ Jesus. And now that you belong to Christ, you are the true children of Abraham. You are his heirs and God's promise to Abraham belongs to you. Abba Father, we are so thankful that you gave your son that through faith in Jesus Christ we become your children adopted, wanted, chosen and we are united in Christ Jesus and because of him we are a new creation we are no longer the old we are new we are all one in Christ Jesus and because we are your children we are able to hold on to your good promises that you have for us I'm going to read Galatians chapter 3, verse 26 to 29 again. Listen to a word or phrase that is speaking to you. Galatians chapter 3, verse 26 to 29. For you are all children of God through faith, in Christ Jesus, and all who have been united with Christ in baptism have put on Christ like putting on new clothes. There is no longer Jew or Gentile, slave or free, male and female. For you are all one in Christ Jesus, and now that you belong to Christ, you are the true children of Abraham. You are his heirs, and God's promise to Abraham belongs to you. What word or phrase stood out to you? What is the Lord speaking to your heart and mind? Let's take some time to dwell on what the Lord is saying to you. There is no need to rush this moment. Stay as long as the Holy Spirit leads. Thank you, Lord, for your word. Your word is the truth. Your word is light in dark places. May your light shine in and through us. May the truth be the only word that dwells in us. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Lord and Savior, we pray. Amen.
as we part, remember to treasure the word in your heart and allow him to renew your mind.